Good morning. It is Friday, which is my favorite. And today we're going to start a brand new project. Unfortunately, it looks like we are going to get rained out. They're saying there's some weather coming in at around 11 o'clock, but I really need to try to start this job. We lost Monday of this week due to rain, and I just can't afford to lose another day. So we'll go and we'll try and we'll just, you know, see what happens. All right, I'm going to take this trash out. I will see you guys at the coffee shop. How much garbage do we make? Good work. <laughs> Spring has been nothing but rain. Oh yeah. That's I mean, car, eh? I mean, we've had nice days mixed in here or there, but it seems like two days a week we're getting rained out. I'll have a good weekend. Yeah, you too. Morning, good. Jessica. Good morning. How are you? All right. It's Friday, which is my favorite. It is your favorite, even yep. though you work Saturdays. It's still your favorite. Still is. Thank you. Thank you. Just pulling into the yard. Bugs is pulling in right behind me. And I saw that big ray is here already. First one to work again. Bugs has got to go saw cut the patio we poured yesterday, first thing. And we're going to head over to this new patio project, which is in, I think it's Eagle, Wisconsin. It's a long ride. It's over 40 minutes away which is definitely outside of my regular service area however uh, this guy is a really cool guy so i agreed to go ahead and do it for him morning bugs morning jade you know how much fuel's in there oh yeah we need to put gas today hopefully not gas oh uh, diesel yeah you actually still have quite a bit yeah it's between quarter and half eric's here Look at Eric got two. Eric got two? Yeah. <laughs> Eric got a double stack first thing in the morning. Yes, sir. Double muffins. That looks so good. <laughs> I want to eat one, but I really shouldn't. Is it apple? Peach? Peach? Oh, man. Tino's here. There's a big accident, dude. No way. Yes, dude. Yeah, on, the, on this way. Oh, oh no. That way? Oh, dude. Oh, that's bad news. I just have a feeling that today is just not going to be a good day. I have a feeling we're going to drive all the way out there, burn all this fuel, and it's going to start pouring out. We're going to have to turn around and come all the way back. Okay, I'm going to run the Speedway, and hopefully these fuel cards work at Speedway because the BP that we were going to, it only has one side, and it's a real hassle the reason i didn't go to speedway because that was a hassle too you had to you know stop at the pump which is pretty far from the building walk into the building give them your credit card go back outside fuel up and then go back inside again stand in line so it was a hassle but bp is more of a hassle so hopefully these right express cards are going to work i still haven't gotten ray his own number pin number for the fuel card I just have to do that. And then I don't have to chase around at all for any of these guys. Just put the right card in and it works. So we're gonna start coming to Speedway regularly now. Speedway! When this is full, don't hang it up. Just set it down. And then fill that transfer tank and the skid loader. The, the white transfer tank is the big one. Yep. Fill this, there's the cap. And then this is the cap. Okay, got it. Right here. All right. And then I'll see you over there. Definitely out in the country now. Lots of animals. A lot of horse farms out here. It's nice, quiet, peaceful, but it's just too far away, you know, for the type of business and stuff that I do. I gotta stay close to all the action. Man, we're gonna have to put the dump truck and trailer out in the road with a bunch of cones. Form truck and all that can come up here. Hi there. Morning, how are you? 
Yeah. Bright eye and bushy tail, you know? Yeah. <laughs> what did you say you did? You cut it? What no, happened? Oh, a jackhammer. Oh, a jackhammer. Yeah. So you jackhammered your foot. Yeah. That would be, <laughs> that would be correct, yes. Uh, ouch. You know, oh, man. Four stitches, two fractures later, right? Yeah. <laughs> you know, We're gonna sidewalk around. You're gonna build a skirt off of this, right? Yeah, actually, the guy who did our porch, we did tin on the top. Yeah. So he had an idea. It's like, well, you could just do the tin all the way down. I'm like, oh, that's a pretty good idea. Yeah. Cause you gotta hide. Up. You gotta hide your <laughs> expert concrete work that you did under there Come somehow. I'll just put the dirt fill down there because you need. You're gonna need a bunch. Do I want it? Huh. If you're giving it away, for sure I'll take it. <laughs> Not a... you saw my handiwork. Yeah. Once you poured that concrete under the deck, you were just done. <laughs> and you jackhammered your foot. He's got some scaling on his stoop. Yeah. It's called scaling. I hate scaling. I didn't pour the stoop, by the way. Morning guys. Good morning. I've been here for a long time. Where you guys been? No way. I've been here for a uh, ten minutes at least. No way. I, I don't know how I low. beat you so bad. I'm trying to I push I put my my foot down and it went. Oh. <laughs> you remember him? Yeah, I remember Steve. Yeah, he was yeah, like actually, yeah. The fire yeah, that's right. You were the chief, right? Or assistant yeah. chief or well I'm the assistant chief. Assistant but... chief. Shovel right here so we can snap a line on the wall, get all the weeds out of there. Okay. So you're going off of this thing or did yeah, you want to cut this section out? This, this well, it's still it's still going to establish your elevation there. Oh, okay. Because that's your driveway height. Hi, Ray. Yes, sir. Finally made it? Yeah. Oh, it went. <laughs> it is. It feels like we're working in a different country. Like way up north, <coughs> cows and chickens. It is over there on the other side. Oh, oh where's your grow? farm now? Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is my farm. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Dairy farm. Yeah. Where's the cow? This is my dairy farm, guys. That biography said I owned a dairy farm. I saw that. It had, like... it had some of the facts okay. mistaken, yeah. <laughs> Well, it's all. It was a completely AI generated biography. Was it? Oh, it's all from like off the internet stuff or whatever. All my videos and information it gathered, it made yeah. the biography all computer generated, which is pretty scary because most of that stuff was correct. Put up some strings, and I got a bunch of digging to do on the one side of the patio, a little bit on the other side. So I'm gonna walk down and grab the skid loader and start digging. We're not gonna need much. He's got too much on the one side already. Oh, that's more than enough. It's a little chunky. A few big rocks in there, but that'll work. It's kind of nice. Don't have to do any trucking today. I gotta take some of that dirt out of there. So you're gonna have to hold up that conduit and shovel against and get that all out of there. Cause once I get that all out of there, I'm gonna take some of this and move it over there. But I wanna get the dirt down first cause it's high all up in there. This was Eric's side job last spring. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> no, that one was. Oh yeah, under. The... How thick did you pour this? That. How thick? Yeah, that thick. 
Oh, like eight inches? Yeah. Even this little piece? This is a little deeper. There you hey. go. Hey, well, that didn't really do much. <laughs> That's only the corner. I'll go get the breaker. It's too much. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop, 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 stop. You see all that dirt on there? If you push all that dirt into the connection, you're pushing all that dirt into your hydraulic system, which is really bad. Put your belly into it, man. Oh, see? Work. Yeah. Did you finally put some weight in it? Oh, yeah. Last, last year, he couldn't get it at all. Oh, I got it. Let's see that. Come on. You guys get so used to me doing everything with the machine. That one's, that one's weak. I only want to go one time with the machine. We got it? He don't mess around. I got it. He doesn't mess around. He doesn't mess around. Right. Tito has like a pride issue here. Yeah, he has his sweat. No, it's not pride. It's That's working hard, dude. I would have did. I would have just did the same thing he did and been out of here already. He's always thinking how to do it faster, you know what I mean? That's how I'm thinking too. Ray means business today. He's got slacks on. He's got dress pants on today. Oh yeah, he's going after. Tom Ford's. Yeah. Oh yeah. Well, at least he tried. Yeah, right. Looks better than me. That's for sure. I'm always grubby. I wear the same pants for like three days in a row. I don't even wash them. Well, I need to see them. Same here. Same here. Same. <laughs> so you pick them up off the yeah, dirty laundry to they're put them on and they're yeah. all stiff. Yeah. You like this. <laughs> yeah. The yeah. starts smelling it. Yeah. Like, yeah. What is this? What's wrong with <laughs> oh, no, that's true. I wear my dirty <laughs> pants all the time. What? In the summertime when you're sweating too much, you got to change yeah, them yeah, right yeah, away. Yeah, yeah. Because that's no good for you. Yeah. I'm going to put a little initial gravel right here and then go ahead and put like three, four pins here. And then I'll bring gravel. Let's get this little area graded right here before we even move on to the other side. Hey, look at Ray's string on the other side. <laughs> wow, Ray. You gotta Imagine if we start pouring, the gravel was higher than the concrete. It's okay, Ray. There's a footing under there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the one that homeowner poured. <laughs> 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 that was really good. That was a good that one. Was a good one. <laughs> I'll give you credit on that one there. So did your grandparents have this farm too? Yeah. Yep. So it's, oh, it's great grandparents. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, they owned a farm over there, and then I think they sold it and bought this whole place. Yeah. It went farther, I think. It's all graded here. Hey, what are we going to do without bugs? Who's going to compact? That was good. I was telling Eric. Yeah. I don't hear the compactor yet. Yeah. What is bugs? Oh, it would have been all right. Really? Ready. really? Yeah. Yeah, we better hurry up then. Yeah. What, feel rain? Yeah. It's supposed to start raining soon. I got concrete coming Monday morning. First thing. We don't have time for rain today. There's always like three hours of work left. He's ready with the compactor standing by the trailer. I'm ready to compact, brother. He loves the compact. Every video he's compacting. Yeah, I know, I know. But he's ready to compact. Pretty much when we show up at the job, he's ready. Hey, the customer gave me this come along. Yeah? He said he never wants to do concrete ever again. <laughs> no yeah, it's true. What is this here? High? Looks high still. Three and a half. Three and a half. Three and a half four. Three and a half four. Three and a half four. 
Four All right, just flatten this out here. Yep. Make sure it's a good three, three quarters. Eric, you can uh, you can set this corner for him now. And then the rest, I'll, I'll come up there and, you know, if we need any gravel or whatever. It should be really close, so. I'm gonna dig this down here. So there's gonna be a, a little sidewalk that comes out and then goes that way. And then there'll be a couple steps going down to the patio there. I forgot to grab two by eights this morning. I didn't really think of it. And we have nothing for the steps. So, hey, what's this? Maybe we do have one. Maybe we have one. Aha. Never mind. We did have a couple hiding under there. Beautiful. It's not raining yet. Oh no. It's gonna let us finish. Okay. We only need another hour and we're done. Yes. Eric, set a uh, <laughs> set a two by four right off of here. Uh -huh. Just you can set that one. Okay. Just let it run by and just put you know eighth of bubble. You watch the step video, so yeah. now you know how. That was nice. All right. <laughs> oh, he's calling. My wife said she can't find the cat. I like that video. Find it the was cat. Very yeah. Oh boy. Yeah. It's Your not cat? good. My cat. I don't oh. know. She doesn't know where the cat is. I need some weight on this board. Hey, Ray. I'm coming. Okay. <laughs> stand on this edge. Cut your heel off. Heel? No, I don't want my toe cut off. My toe, maybe. All right. So this is all flat up here. This is your first step down. You're gonna have two steps. You'll have step, step. Well, it'll be step and then step somewhere down there. This corner here, we can put a form like straight and straight and you can have it for a little planter or if you just want no maintenance, we can concrete the whole corner in. That's the question. Uh, for that spot, I would say just concrete the whole corner. You can always put like a, pot, a nice pot to plant too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I would concrete if it was mine. Yeah. But I, I thought I'd ask before. No, I snap a line right up right up on the step, Eric. Please try to hook up. Just barely up above the ugliness. Okay. Oh. It's right behind you. Right we just got to get above the ugliness. Bring it down a little bit. That's good right there. Don't hit the house or the siding. It's brand new. I'm serious. No, don't. That's not good enough. Don't say I won't try to. Just say I won't do it. Okay, Eric. Boy, what, what are you doing? Oh, get that out of there. Right. That's a step. Yeah, that's a step. Imagine Bugs finishing that all sunny strips it and there's <laughs> wood in there. Oh, brother! We got to dig out right here, Ray. See this hump? Here. Here. All through here, dig down a couple inches. So what we're going to do is we're just going to we're just gonna float into your concrete yeah. and then that'll all get covered up anyway. Yeah. We're not gonna put a form or anything. Yeah. It'll it'll all be hidden later. Whatever is easy as possible there. Yeah, I don't there's really no other good option. That's the best option. Okay. I'm gonna throw some gravel in here, grate it. I'll do that right now, actually, Tino. I'll throw a bucket of gravel in there. You can yeah, spread it. it out. Eric can finish this off. Okay. We're gonna beat the rain, buddy. Oh my my wife found the cat, it was outside. <laughs> it's an indoor cat. Oh really? But she wants to go outside, and you know, you can't really stop cats. Oh. Not with seven kids in the house going in and out, of course the cat's going to get out. Yeah, well, she sits right by the door and waits for her opportunity, too. As <laughs> soon as it opens, her. Adios! <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm going to bring a little gravel for that. It went good, right? Oh, this is nice and big and wide, so oh, it'll you. be a nice yeah. six foot wide. Before we go, we got to dig this pipe in, too. Maybe an inch under the gravel. Okay. We'll just trace it and then dig maybe like this so we just put it in the gravel and cover it okay. grab the hand compactor ray you know what would be really cool tool all the joints in uh -huh. 
tool a border in. I can't promise a border. It depends on how hard the concrete's border. getting. Border? Yeah. Yeah. Just don't worry about that. If we have time, we'll do it. We could do it. We could do a. We could do a border, and then and then tool all the joints in. Yeah. And then just go over it with texture, over all the joints and everything. Oh, Eric, I got the new stamps yesterday. Where? At my house. Delivered. Which ones? They're so nice. The random <laughs> stones. The random stones? <sighs> I got to see them. They're so nice. The stones are pretty big. They're yeah. bigger than like the, the, the old pattern yeah, yeah. where yeah, they were like yeah, only yeah, about this yeah. big. They're like, they're like that big. Skid steer is on the trailer and we are just about out of here. That went pretty quick. It's only 11-11. Rain was supposed to start between 10 and 11. No rain yet. It is dark all the way around us, but I am very, very happy about getting that patio set up. Oh, look at Ray. He's coming to help. Ray doesn't play, man. He likes to help. He's a hustler. I don't have anybody else. I haven't had anybody else for a long time that would run like that. Ray's here. You're running so fast. Your beard just split wide open. <laughs> I told him we're gonna put it on the farm farm truck because I don't want to wait for them. This is a John Deere 6115R with an aftermarket quickie loader. Pretty nice. It doesn't look very old. Um, not very fast, but they still make it. <laughs> not yeah, fast. not real quick. Rosie! Rosie, come here. Let me see her. Oh, that's like, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That one's big, too. It doesn't look like someone. <laughs> <laughs> what are you trying to say? I ain't going to agree. <laughs> your dogs eat good, though. Like, oh, really, really oh. good. What you feed them? What do you feed them? Like, oh, my sides goodness. of beef? Wow! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> worse than my dog. Is she? Hey, yeah. imagine if you put spray glue on your glove and then... <laughs> so, my only... I'm not opposed to it because I do like the stamps. Yeah. Um, but is there anything special, I guess... Well, like the sealer is sealer's like every four or five years. It's not every year. It's nothing like that. Okay. So we were under the so, impression So, we were lying. No. Stamp... Okay. Okay. Well, generally what happens is guys that don't want to do one particular, you know, aspect of work, they'll talk you out of it. Okay. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh yeah. They, no, they, did they didn't. This, so. They didn't want to stamp it, so they'll t tell you that stamping's no good. You shouldn't stamp it. <laughs> Eric's too short. It's got to be me and you. Yeah. When me and him try to lift the whacker, I only get the one side on there. I bet if you put the whacker on the dog's back, it could just run right down the hill. This dog is beefy. How'd you get so beefy? Big girl right here. She is thick. She's a thick mama. Oh, let us put this up first, Eric. Ooh, that's hot. You like the steps and everything? Yes. Yeah, yeah, I made it six foot really wide over there. Yeah, yeah. So, yep. Adios. Yep, thank you. Hey, good one. See ya. Payroll checks. <laughs> Pino. <laughs> hey, Eric. Eric. Thank you. Yep, all right. Uh, I'm not going back to the yard, so I guess I'll just see you guys Monday. All right, thank you very much. We'll oh, see you Monday. Yeah, we'll be here Monday, here Monday about the same time we got here this morning. No, you keep that till Monday. That's fine. I'm already loaded, so. <laughs> Super nice customers, which is good. It's kind of offsetting a couple not so nice customers that I'm dealing with at the moment. I would say I have 99% great customers, maybe even more than 99%. And then I have 1% or less that are just impossible. But that's enough complaining. We're out of here. I'll see you guys bright and early on Monday. Adios. Good morning. It is Monday, which is not my favorite. Although I'm in a little bit better mood today. The last couple of Mondays have been rain days. And as you can see, it is a beautiful day here in Wisconsin. We're going out to Eagle, Wisconsin. We're pouring a large patio. The patio is about 16 yards with the sidewalk. It's going to be about 18 yards. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet. Uh, the, the client is kind of open. I might use the brand new stamps. I might just do a texture stamp. I'm just not sure yet. We'll see how it goes. But first, I'm gonna take this trash out. I'll see you guys at the coffee shop. How much garbage do we make? Good work. 
today is best mom monday so i'm just gonna grab some coffee and that's it no food this morning Very easy morning, Missy. <laughs> All right. All right. Thank you. You have a good one. You See too. You next time. Pulling in the Riv Crete. I'm gonna grab some more liquid release, and I'm gonna get a bucket of light gray release as well, because I'm still not sure how we're gonna stamp this patio, or even if we're gonna stamp the patio. Be the coolest for him. I want to do something nice for him. He's a really, really nice guy. Super nice guy. I'm here really early. It's only six o'clock. I don't even know if anybody's here yet. I might have to come back after I go to the yard. Morning. Is it too early to get some release? It is, but what do you got? Uh, I just gotta get a light gray release and then one bucket of clear liquid release. Light gray and a clear. Thank you very much. You're welcome, have a good one. Appreciate it. 614 just rolling into the shop and Bugs is here. He's the only one here so far. Everybody else will be coming in quickly here. There's Jade. She's ready to pounce. I'm gonna grab my aggressive texture seamless stamps and I'm gonna bring both sets. I have the brand new set, the random stone already loaded in the back here. So I'm gonna bring them both and then um, maybe I'll run it past the guy or I don't know, we'll see. At least I'll be prepared for either way. I gotta move this trailer. Probably just gonna go with these aggressive texture seamless stamps I'm leaning towards that with a powdered release I like to use the new ones but yeah I think I'll just go with these I think I'll cut a border in and then I'll just use the texture and then we'll saw cut tomorrow raise here yeah you know we do need to take the Mac do? yeah we don't need the trailer though because okay, yeah i have a mechanic that's out there really close to there yeah he's got a brand new bumper ready to put on so when we're done working i'll take you over there he said he'll slap it on right away hi jay did you come over to help are you here to help all right stamps are all loaded i got six of those no that's it i don't think we need anything else morning, morning. we got plastic and tape right yeah i got tape see Eric pulling in. Eric's here. We need Tino. It's a it's a good sized patio. Need all hands on deck. Ready Eric? Are you okay? I'm ready baby. All right. I don't see Tino yet. Oh, you didn't see him by the road? No. Oh. Tino where are you? Oh he's calling me right back. That's good. Are you almost here? All right, it's 6.31, we're taking off. I'm gonna order concrete now. Hey, it's Ryan from Victory. Good morning, sir. Hi, I have an eight o'clock out in Eagle. Um, give me 18 and a half yards. 18 That's and a half, mm-hmm. Six and a half bag, low churred air, microfiber, five inch slump, 20 minutes apart, and put a half percent NCA. All right, thank you. All right. We'll talk to you later. Yep, bye. Concrete's ordered. No rain at all today. No rain tomorrow. It should be a pretty good week. They're saying rain maybe Friday, but that's a long time from now. So we'll see what happens. And yes, I do have a cracked windshield. So something hit my windshield on, a free, on the freeway a long time ago and it's spreading. So it's just kind of what happens. We're here, just pulling in. Morning. Good, how are you? Yeah. A little chilled to be honest with you. A little chilly, <laughs> yeah. That's good for us though. We like chilly. You got my money already? I told you I had it Friday. I know, but we're not even done yet. I trust you. You showed up. <laughs> oh, that's, that's a that. <laughs> big mistake. So I'm gonna use these here as long as you're okay with it. So I'm just gonna put a little extra like gray color on it so it oh, thank you. separates it out. Sure. It has some nice veining. Looks cool. It's a really nice texture. I trust you. It'll give it some uh, character sure. instead of just a big white plain area. 
I mean, it's going to be regular concrete color, but it'll have some light, lighter gray mixed into it, so it won't look like regular concrete at all. Oh, okay. It'll look like stone. Hey, It'll be pretty you know cool. I'm not going to stamp that pad up there. I'm just going to stamp the patio. And what I'll do is I'll cut a joint right here, and that'll separate the regular concrete from the stamp concrete. We got to get the reinforcement in there right away, Eric. <sighs> Really need to bring a few power buggies around this way for the top pad. I think we'll just come around the house with maybe like three or four power buggies. Yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll bring three or four this way and then bring the rest from the bottom. Pretty nice out here, eh? Why are we all the way out here, man? That's the, uh, that's the fire chief from Eagle. Remember when yeah, we did yeah. the picnic last yeah. year? I knew it had to be some kind of connection. Yeah. But it's a pretty big job too, yeah, so. Work pretty well. Uh, so far, so good. <laughs> I just started using this stuff this year, so it's only been a few times, but Ray cleans the buggy pretty good. But these get messy really, really fast. Concrete spraying all over them all the time. All the wire, right away. Yes, right away. Okay. Ah, the truck doesn't drive in here. Concrete's here. Why does it seem like he's so early? Oh, he's not early. It's 7:59. We just been taking too long. I'm gonna get this out of the way and pull him in. Here he comes. We'll go around and fill them steps first. This is where the magic happens, yep. It's not even mixed either, there's still sand in it as you can see. So we're gonna put four gallons in there and mix it up. Quite a bit of water to this load. It kept stiffening up every three, four buggies, surprisingly. I mean, it's cool out. It shouldn't be doing that. Man, that first truck had nine yards. That does not look like nine yards. That was his side job. Eric did that on the side. That's how I got this job. shoots on and then pull up and just shoot it we're gonna get this out of here now it sounds like he's almost empty you, you hear that yeah, yeah, one, one more we'll just come up the hill man please don't run out want to get a piece of water yeah can you scrape that i'll let you score up we'll come up the hill Oh, I ordered extra, but where that first truck ended made me nervous. I gotta get these boots off and go bull float. 
it took a little longer than I was hoping. A lot of splashing, a lot of mess. Stinko great. Got caught up in the wire mesh once. Bug's gonna have a lot of a lot of washing tomorrow morning when it comes to saw cut, but we'll get it all nice and clean. Man, this stuff is difficult to work with. It's just popping pretty quick. Hey, she got loose. Is she loose? Yes, she is. Oh. Oh, she, she put her footprint in the concrete. And she's hung up on the string too. Oh, Jade. I think Jade's gonna need longer stakes, Bugs. Yeah, this stuff is not playing games. That's for sure. I mean, we just dumped that right now, wet. I don't know why it's set up so fast. This is the same concrete we used on that other patio. Remember we were sitting around doing nothing. We were like, oh, it's not ready yet. It's not ready yet. It's the same concrete. Bugs, can you, can you put an edger mark so I can keep this going here real quick? I lost my spacer. From this joint, that way is all standard. I'm only stamping from this joint that way. So you just stick with the steps and we'll handle the rest. Good thing I had nothing crazy planned for this patio. Texture skins are gonna be about all I can handle right now. And I'm gonna have to move even with those, dude. I'm serious. I mean, look at this stuff. I can barely get the joint. It's ridiculous. There's no reason it's set up this quick. All right. That's all the borders that we're doing. Just to dress it up a touch. I'm gonna get a drink of water. And then hopefully by that time he'll be around here. Eric will be back and then I can start putting release here and, and jump on it right away. All right, I'm gonna start working on the borders slowly. I just want to be gentle on that joint. I don't want to close it all in. So I'm going to go along the borders and tamp them in by hand to get a better feel for it. Go Eric, go Eric. But this is what we got is the blue one, the other one. No, this one's not thick. It's got, it's kind of sharp in the middle. See that? But then it's got texture along the side of the edge. So it looks like the joint is like natural, you know? I'm just drawing in some lines, make it look like random pieces of stone were laid around the edge, the perimeter of the patio. Jade. It just looks a lot better than being plain, I think. I think it sets it off a little bit. All right, this is ready. I'm gonna get on brand new stamps. I bought these last fall and I never used them. Yep, it's perfect right now. Perfect. Texture skins are very easy money. You know, turn and get the get it blended. Turn this way now. You got to get the blended because see where it, it's different. Going to be different colors. Okay. Hurry, yeah, just turn now. Leave that alone. Turn and get that blended quickly. Take it easy with the color because I I don't have. This is the only bucket I got. You got that from the hot truck? Yeah. No, I bought it. It's the only bucket of light gray I got. You can do a little more than that. You're gonna need a little more than that, Eric. It's got to be fully covered at least. You just don't want to go crazy with it. All right, I'm coming around the bend. Tino's over here scrubbing the concrete. Still. Okay. 
Where's that little bendy that I had out? I had that cut specifically to go in the joint. I cut it perfect. Stamp right over Tino because he's in the way. I'm coming in a couple minutes, Tino. Okay. So hurry up, buddy. Stand it up in the joint, vertically. Put, vertically. Vertically means up and down. Stop it, stop it. Look at me. Put the form vertical. Vertical, that's horizontal. This is vertical. Sure. Flip it like this. Now put it in the joint. Oh, okay, through the dust. So the dust doesn't go. Gotcha, gotcha, Bob. No, 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 other joint. Don't touch the concrete though. Reach your way out, it's gotta go all the way to the wall. I gotta cut so it fits perfect. Oh. Just be very, oh. oh. Now set it in the joint. Pull it towards you just a touch so it goes down. There you go. Now keep it in the joint. Don't touch bug's work. Careful. To the left. To the right. Up. Okay, down. Up a little. Watch out for the back. Okay. Watch out for the front. Yeah. Scary, man. Now just wiggle it down a little bit so it's in the joint and it'll stick. It'll stay by itself. There you go. See, it's not that hard. You made me over. You made me So I was making you nervous? Come on. <laughs> I'm gonna give that a break that's been sitting in the shade. And I'll start over here and then we'll come back to over there. This is a big patio. I don't know how it looks on video, but uh, it was 18 yards. I ordered 18 and a half yards and he was he was just about out. You could hear it. I told you we're gonna stamp right over your Meg. You know. Yeah. Here it comes. Go Tito! Go Tito! Scrubby Dubby! Go Eric! Go Eric! Go Eric! Hey, okay. e Eric, good thing you're not just starting there and you gotta go that way. <laughs> Imagine if it was like that and you were finishing going that way. Uh, oh, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Man, it's gonna be real tight on the release. Well, we got that pretty much covered out there though. Pretty close, yeah. yeah we need a little spot there. Once you're done, there's another blue mat in my truck. There's two more. Stamp this because we gotta keep going. We still gotta stamp over there. Let me just throw a little more here and then he can take it. It looks super good. But that was a lot of work, man. That's a, lot. a lot of work, I'm tired. That thumper, once you really have to start leaning on it, it is a workout. I mean, it's like a thousand reps of anything will just about kill you. I don't care if it's a five pound dumbbell, a thousand reps will crush you. We got it. I got one more handful. We're good. Look at that. That's all we got left. <laughs> one handful. We need to do both of them. Like it turned out good. That was a bit of a bit of a workout. But I'll show you the texture here and I'll walk around. Everything got good even texture. But we had to work over there. I'm shot. You can see all the texture over there. It's all the same, which is what you gotta be careful of. That's why we had to hit it so hard over here. Everything's got good texture. That right there is just a little pile of release that got dumped off a of mat. That's nothing, that's not a mistake. The border looks real good. Bugs will come here tomorrow and saw cut it, wash it. I'll seal it in about a week. He's gonna bring um, some skirting down on that deck. So all that under there is gonna be completely blocked from view. And obviously he's gonna build a set of steps coming out too. So my mom's here, so it's lunchtime. Yeah, that's cool. If we don't eat lunch now, my mom. Wait, wait, what did you just say, Ray? Uh -huh. Did you say it wasn't easy money? That's what you said. All right, you might as well hit the road. Literally, you just paid me thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars to work out. I'm Thank you. <laughs> the hotter it gets, the faster you have to work. That's the most difficult part about concrete is the heat of the summer. Hi, right, mom. Wednesday, we're gonna bury your book. How I are have you? A surprise for you. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> oh, hi, Autumn. Hi. Surprise. What are you doing here? Surprise. Wow. Oh, Autumn's here. You probably remember Autumn. She was at I the do. picnic yeah. last year. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I had no idea you were here. <laughs> oh, I gotta sit down, man. Well, I got a couple of chairs, so grab one. One is good for me. I'm filthy with release. That's the downside of powder to release it. It it is so dirty. I mean, watch this. Watch. How can you see any of your glasses even? I can. Who is talking? Oh wow! Look at that. 
Look Your at that. Your eyes are like a shade. <laughs> I know. Thank you. I can see clearly now the release is gone. Oh yeah, wow, look at that. This one I call Big Mama. Yeah, it's big. Yeah, she's so thick. <laughs> Eric Look just you're just starting with the cookies, yeah, Eric. Got his pockets full already. Man, <laughs> Eric. Oh, look at the dog. Oh yeah, she knows her food. I think she's had her share of table scraps oh, yeah. from the yeah. appearance of things. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta tell Ray he's gotta come and get his last meal. Come on, Ray. Did you bring butter? <laughs> you need butter? Yes, butter. I'm hungry, but I'm not hungry yet. My stomach's got to settle. Ooh, that looks good with the avocado. Mm-mm. Are you ready for a whole nother season of easy money, Auto? Oh, yeah. Good. Now, you got to keep your dogs off it for a little while. Because if Big Mama walks in that patio, she's going to leave a mark. <laughs> yeah, big marks. Bye, thank you. I'm really dirty, so. I know. I know you have. No, Check not really. Right. Yeah, of course. All right, thank you. I'll see you again because I'll be the one that comes back to seal it. Bugs will be here to wash it, well, but I, I, won't be I do all the sealing. All right, adios. Yep. Me and him are gonna go get a new bumper on the truck. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's ready. He said he'll just zip it, zip it on real quick. All right, adios. All right, let's go get that bumper put on the Mac. Ray's right behind me. We're pulling in the best truck. If you remember, this is where I got the box put on. And at that time, I had them order a bumper, but it didn't come in to where they could work on it. It was gonna be like a three week wait. But it's in now, and we were just a few miles from here. All right, good, how are you? You got your butt? Yeah, he, driver's here right now. All right, we'll get you taken care of right away. My last couple drivers were a little rough on the front of the truck, as you can see. All right, thank you very much. Oh, I didn't pay for this yet. We'll get you taken care of. You're gonna send me a bill, email I'll me or something? Email, All right, yeah. yep, that sounds good. All right, thank you. All right, I'll see you in the morning, Ray. <laughs> yes, I know there's release on my face, but I'll see you guys in the morning. Adios.